my name is Kelly and I'm one of the educators with Bywater Solutions and I have this short tutorial for you, the patron, on how to reset your password or because you forgot your password, get a new password. So we're going to start with what if you forgot your password to your library public catalog. With Koa, there are, on my Koa screen, there are two ways to log in. I have one over here on the right and then I have one in the top right. You may only have one of those, but uh, but believe me when you say either way, we'll get you to this forgot your password. So I can see forgot your password here, but let me do this log into your account up here and I have this forgot your password. So I'll go ahead and click that. Now I can either enter my login or my email address. Now as a um, person that possibly has multiple emails um, accounts with my email in there. I'm going to do my login. But I could also do my login and my email. So I'm going to enter my login information. I'm going to hit submit. It's telling me that I'll receive an email shortly and then I'll click that link to reset my password. So let's go ahead and see what happens. I'm going to pop over to my email. There it is, Koha Password Recovery. So it tells me this, this has been sent in response to a password recovery. So I have two days to click that link. I can click it and now I'm going to set a new password. Now there are different um, Restrictions on passwords depending on your library catalog. My password only has to be three characters, but there may be libraries that require more than three characters as well as that uppercase, lowercase, number, special character process. So I'm going to go ahead and um, confirm my new password. So there I am. Um, it has been changed, so let's go ahead and log in. really wants me to do another password, doesn't it? Log in. Once I'm logged in, here I go, I'm here. So I can see it brings me right to my account summary and um, tells me what I've checked out. And I also have some options on the left, which will bring me to where you can change your password. So here over on the left, um, you have some options depending on your library. You have may have more than this option, more than these options or less than these options, but I do have that option to change my password. So if I go ahead and click change your password, I'm going to have to put in my current password and then I'm going to put in my new password. Let's go ahead and submit those changes. So you need to know your new password so it has been updated. This was just a short tutorial video on how to reset your password or do that forgot your password link. Thank you for watching. This tutorial has been a production of Bywater Solutions.